Hey everyone, this is Wumbo, and today we're talking about all the recipes for this year's Dawning 2020. I already masterworked the oven, which I'm sure the majority of players have also done that, but for those of you who haven't, you're in luck, because I am here to tell you what's going on. But, before we get started, I'd like to tell you guys that I'm no longer going to be promoting my Discord server. It's not working out right now with how small the channel is, and it finally took me this long to acknowledge that. So instead of doing this whole spiel at the beginning of each video, I'm just going to ask you politely to hit that notification bell and set it to all. I don't upload a crazy bunch on YouTube, so I won't be blowing up your inbox, and if you decide later you don't really care, you can go ahead and uncheck it. Whatever suits you, my friend. Now back to the video. So we're not going to waste any time at all. I'm just going to show and tell each batch of treats you can make, who it's for, and how to make it. Okay, so here it is. If you didn't masterwork, it's, you're going to have a different screen. It's going to have a set up here and a set down here, but whatever, it doesn't matter. So for the first one, these are going to be for Zavala in the tower courtyard. You're going to need Ether Cane, Delicious Explosion, in Essence of Dawning, obviously. Next is for Ikora Ray in the tower bazaar. You need Kabbalah Oil, Flash of Inspiration, in Essence again. Next, you need to deliver these to Amanda Holiday in the tower hanger. You need Cabal Oil, Null Taste, and again, Essence. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop telling you about the Essence now because it's kind of becoming repetitive. Anyways, these go to Banshee in the Tower Courtyard. You need Vex Milk and Bullet Spray. These go to Hawthorne's Falcon in the Tower Bazaar. You need Ether Cane and Personal Touch. These go to Devrim K in the Trossland for the EDZ. You need Ether Cane and Perfect Taste. These here go to Failsafe in the Exodus Black on Nessus. You need Vex Milk and Impossible Heat. These go to Lord Shax in the Tower Courtyard. You need Cabal Oil and Sharp Flavor. To the Drifter in the Annex, you need Taken Butter and Null Taste. To the Spider in the Safe House in the Tangled Shore, you need Dark Ether Cane and a Flash of Inspiration. For Petra Venge, she needs Dark Ether Cane and Impossible Heat. For Zer, I have no idea where he is, or where he's going to be, rather, on the weekend, you need Taken Butter and Electric Flavor. Next, you deliver these to Riven. Um... I, I honestly have, I've never delivered these, they just kind of expired, I didn't really care for them, so, um, anyway. You need Taken Butter and Delicious Explosion. These need to go to Saint-14 in the Tower Hangar, Vex Milk and Personal Touch. Next, we have Eris Morn on the Moon, you need Chitin, pa Chitin, pa I'm, okay, I was just, okay, whatever. You need the Powder and Finishing Touch. Next, you need the... the God damn it. These go to Varix on Europa, you, you need that Powder again with Electric Flavor. Next, these go to Sean the Cosmodrome. You need Ether Cane and Bullet Spray. The Bittersweet Biscotti go to Crow on the Tangled Shore. Dark Ether Cane and Balanced Flavors. Next, go to Tess in the Tower. We need the Powder and Multifaceted Flavors. And then, alas, these go to Eva. Or Eva, Eva. <laughs> These go to her in the tower courtyard. You need taken butter and superb texture. And since this video is extra short, I'll quickly go over how to get the ingredients. So the easiest drops you'll get, I'll refer to them as uncommon ingredients, can drop just by you doing normal activities across the solar system. So we'll get started right away. Vex milk can be collected by killing Vex. This is most commonly found on Europa and Nessus. Next is Ether Cane, which can be collected from Fallen. This is most commonly found on the EDZ, Cosmodrome, Moon, Tangled Shore, and Europa. Third is Cabal Oil, which can be collected from Cabal, which is also most commonly found in the EDZ and Tangled Shore. Chitin Powder is collected from Hive and is most commonly found on the Tangled Shore, Moon, and Dreaming City. Taken Butter is collected from Taken. It's found the most on the EDZ and Dreaming City. Last on the uncommon ingredients list is Dark Ether Cane. This is collected by Killing Scorn, which is found on the Tangled Shore in Dreaming City. Now for the rare ingredients. These can be collected by only killing enemies in extremely specific ways. First up is Delicious Explosion. These are collected by getting explosive kills of any kind, ranging from your class grenade to grenade launchers to rocket launchers. Second is Sharp Flavor. This is found by getting sword kills on any enemy type. Impossible Heat can be found by getting solar kills with either class ability or weapon element. Electric Flavor are kills with either class abilities or weapon element. Null Taste Void kills with either class abilities or weapon element. Flash of Inspiration can be found by generating orbs of light with masterworked weapons or supers. This is by far the most difficult one to get in my opinion. Next is Personal Touch, which is melee kills on any enemy type. Perfect Taste can be collected by getting precision kills. Bullet Spray can be found by getting kills with automatic weapons, which range from heavy machine guns to auto rifles to submachine guns. Finishing Touch can be collected by doing finishers on any enemy type. Multi-faceted... Multi... 
Multi-faceted flavors can be collected by earning multi-kills on any enemy type. Pinch of Light is found by generating orbs of light. Balanced flavors collected from bow kills, sniper kills, and scout rifle kills. And then last is Superb Texture, which is found by getting super kills on any enemy type. But that's all I have for you today. Thank you everyone for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment. You don't have to do any of those things, but I'm asking you, so please. Alright, thank you once again, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.